there are several ways to select things in edit mode. Let's take a look at some of them. To start, press 1 for vertex select, 2 for edge select, and 3 for face select. You can also hit A to select all. Hit A twice to deselect all. If you want to select multiple parts, you can hold down shift and click. If you want to select the shortest path between two points, you can hold control and click. B brings up box select, and you can just click and drag. If you want to deselect, click and drag with the middle mouse button. C activates circle select, and you can control the radius with the mouse wheel. Right click or escape to cancel that. Control I selects the inverse of what you currently have selected. You can hold Alt and click to select a loop. The trick is to click between two parts you want in the loop. Control and Alt and click in edge mode to select rings. Control plus or minus expands or contracts your selection, and Control shift plus or minus selects or deselects the next part based on what you have selected already. If you have one object that is made up of separated pieces, you can hover over a piece and hit L and it will select just that piece. Shift L deselects. Control L selects the remaining attached parts of anything you have selected. Shift G selects similar, which is useful, but pretty confusing at first. And one of the most important selection tools is F3 for search. I'll demonstrate this UV sphere. In edge select, I'll hit Control Alt select to select the edge rings. Then search with F3 and type in check or deselect. Then search again and select edge loops. Here are some selection shortcuts.